There are certain clubs in baseball that only certain individuals can accomplish. There has been unknown amounts of baseball being played, but these individuals taking the field right now are a very special group. Many home runs have been hit over the many years. It just, it's, it's crazy. Balls are flying out of the stadium every single game. One special group has done this more than anybody else. Although there is some players that aren't in this game, so I can't use them, but this is, this is still players on the on the list one specific baseball team might be the most fierce slash scary team to ever be assembled look out in the nosebleed section susan this is the 500 home run club part two don't blink for a second because you can't if you blink you will miss a moonshot i don't know what team that's been put together over the last however many months where every single human body taking the field right now has steam. Steam in places that have never been seen steam. I did this way too long ago. At the end of this video, or what? At the end of that last video, I said that I was going to redo this specific team when everybody had upgrades because the only 99 overalls in that lineup was Frank Thomas and Willie Mays. It was brought to my attention on Twitter that my stupid ass said that and I completely forgot. I may have to revisit this team when the signature versions of these players are released. Like the Mike Schmidt, Babe Ruth, Griffey, even maybe an Ernie Banks, maybe even Eddie. Jimmy Fox, too. There could be every single player that was in this lineup have a signature. To be honest with you, I was very much glad that it was brought to my attention because I don't even know if I ever would have done this again. So it's coming back. Every single person in this lineup right now is in the 500 home run club. Thank shit I don't have to worry about the bullpen for this specific one because that's unnecessary. I don't have to worry about getting screwed by the bullpen this time because I only have to worry about the starting lineup. So as mentioned, every single player besides Frank Thomas and Willie Mays are upgraded versions of the previous team I was using. Everybody could have been a 99, but unfortunately the 99 Jimmy Fox doesn't have catcher as a secondary position, which is very fucking weird and and I don't know why that's a thing, but unfortunately, the 99 Jimmy Fox could not make it today. Only the 95 could. But Jimmy is behind the plate, and I've never been more happy. Jimmy is an absolute animal, a caged animal. In 30 games with Jimmy Fox, 444 is somehow the average. Sometimes I even wonder if these stats are even accurate. It's like when you go to A&W and you see that one damn burger is like eight bucks, and you think it's a fib. No, actually it's eight bucks and it's probably worth the eight dollars, but that's crazy. Frank Thomas is at first base. This is probably the only time that Frank Thomas will ever find his ass in the starting lineup. Every single time that a team is assembled that Frank Thomas could possibly be on, I, I put him on the bench. I have played 21 games with Frank Thomas some somehow. I, it may have, it probably was early as hell in the season. 391, I mean, that's not a shock at all. Where's the damn fielding percentage? Mike Schmidt, unfortunately, is out of position for this specific team. This is what I did the first time. I put Mike Schmidt at second base because I think third baseman, technically, they can have good animations when you play them out of position in the infield, but it's just that their fielding drops astronomically. So as long as they can make the play, then they will be able to get the out. If that, well, I don't know if that was worded right, but if, if he can come up with a ground ball, it, it, it will be made. Ernie Banks is at short. I haven't used him in a long ass time, I think. What? There's no way I only played one game with Ernie Banks. So I guess don't even look at the stats because that's not even a thing. I, that's the sample size that is non-existent. I mean, I had to put Eddie back in because fuck. He's on the list. And I'm not talking about Chris Jericho. I'm talking about he's on the 500 club list. He's in the VIP section getting bottle service on the list. I don't know if it's too early to say he's turned things around because I mean, really, honestly, all he had to do was get one hit and that's turned shit around for this guy. This guy was a rotten salami stick for the longest time and he couldn't even get on the board. 99, Babe Ruth is here. I did not know that he was that damn expensive on the market, but I'm sticking to my word and I'm doing this team again with the upgraded versions. 125 everything. 
except for vision didn't he have awful feeling last year or something or i don't remember and 64 speed is not fast i'm only batting 200 with him because all those five games are in br and i think i only have okay i have two hits with him willie mays is in center field talk about people who've turned the damn year around 80 games i played with him that's a lot I didn't know it was that much. And Griffey is in right field, which is probably, I was considering putting Babe Ruth in right field and Griffey in center, I swear to God. 88 games for Griffey and 420 average, that's the thing. If he wasn't an absolute machine at the plate, then there's probably no chance I'd use him. I don't remember how many home runs this team hit in the first video I did this. I probably should have gone back and looked actually, but yeah. I should have. That would have made the most sense because, I mean, not the only purpose of this is to hit home runs, but I mean, it would it would be fitting. Damn it. I wanted to face a lefty. That's all right, though. This guy's from Newfoundland, so. Probably playing in the middle of a snowstorm if I'm guessing right. I haven't seen this 99 Christy Matthewson yet. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Holy shit. How are people playing that many games and still have their eyes intact? Ripping them out of their skulls and Scherzer is sprinkling some of that uh, Pitching dust onto the starting rotation Oh no, damn it. Actually that was all right. Oh here. Here we go Okay, it is gonna be a problem isn't it? Yep It's just gonna be a matter of if he can make the play if he can gobble the ground balls up It will be no problem. That's fitting too. the first ground well, the first ball that was put in play is to the second baseman Don't start a rally from that please Oh no. Oh my fuck no. Oh no. Jesus Christ. Okay, that might have been not bad. Oh, this is the guy whose uh, back is pretty much in shambles by the time he throws a pitch. I thought I had way more righties in right now, but that's not even close to the case. Get out. I'll take it. Oh shit sakes, Frank. What, what's he gonna do for the team today? Do something. Do something, Frank. Okay. Wow. Just the way Jimmy grips the bat scares the living shit out of me. You know what? Look at his hands. My walk, Jimmy. Jesus, if there was ever anybody in the lineup with a green light possibly. Okay. I wasn't tempted. Ernie, dude, this is the chance to turn this into something crazy. Absolutely not. This would have been a 3-0 count if I wasn't a toolbox. Thank God. The hell is going on with the offense? Oh, here we go. I, I can't speak. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. That was a bad pitch to start. I would have swung at that if it was up by my eyeballs, so. What, what? Huh, I thought that was somewhat gonna be located. What are the odds he steals? Beautiful. Don't bosh this, Eddie, or he's benched. Why is he not stealing with Ricky Henderson? He's staying put. He's not even flinching. Oh, I spoke too soon. That's an easy stolen bag. Wait a minute, where's that going? What, what? Get my hands and palm all before this game began? That's a nice block. That's Jimmy. Jimmy blocks every single pitch. Get the fielding stat out of the game. Well, Schmidt, you might have a rough day in the field, so let's have a big one at the plate. Matthewson has junk, junk, and more junk. Just remember that, pretty much. And then when he sneaks in a fastball, I'm not ready for it. That looked like a strike, but he just walked Kershaw on four pitches. Oh no. Oh wait. That was bad. Listen, I need to relax here because I'm getting hits up the ass right now. I need to relax and wait for something that's actually in the zone. That's a beautiful take there, Mr. Sir. Wait for it. Wait for like a skip the dishes order when you're waiting there all damn day for your fucking food. And you're like, what the fuck is going on? How does shit have a damn good rating? Griffey. That's a missile out of the state. I almost hit that reliever in the head. Babe needs a damn hit. Screw the home run. Get this guy on the board. Jesus, not, that's not going to do it. The goal of this game is to get Babe Ruth a damn hit. Oh, God. This is the fucking pitcher, too. Oh, he made it. See, like, Schmidt can play a little second base right now. Just a little bit. It's a nice fastball again. Kershaw might be uh, in the driver's seat so far, at least. If I pitch two back-to-back -back games with good performances, this might be the first time all season it's happened. Maybe ever. I have never in my entire life wanted to see a pitch back. 
Oh, I thought that was getting down. All right, Eddie, come on, man. The fucking hair is non-existent, of course. It disappeared into the abyss. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind uh, on two. Listen. There he is! Through the hole on the right side! The hole has never been more fluid. On that side. That's gonna be fair. Everyone's getting hits right now. Oh my fuck, am I fucking pathetic or something, man? What is that? That's disgraceful to the humanity. Jesus, imagine if that was a rope to the gap. Fuck! Oh wait. Man, oh man, Kershaw is, uh, firing the fastball today. Man, oh man, look at these! Just located, like, the three best pitches I've ever seen. Jesus, Pujols is walking back to the dugout now. In this point, Kershaw is sprinting back to his car in the parking lot after the game because everyone's meeting him in the parking lot with a crowbar. <sighs> That's like... Nope. Maybe. Nope. Okay, Frank, that, that, yeah. That's you, Frank. A hanging curveball to fucking Mr. Amazing. Come on, babe. Women are throwing their damn undergarments on the field. It's time to get a hit. I don't think it'll ever happen. What? What? No, that was bad. That was very pathetic. It was not good at all. Oh boy, what the hell's going on now? Oh my Jesus, that's not good at all either. Obey with the grab? Foul, oh, go foul. Man, oh man, I want to go back to that, but I feel like he's waiting for it now. Oh, God. Don't do it. Not happening. Come on, Jimmy. Fuck, dude. Jimmy needs to get on base right now. Did Jimmy have a hit? Yeah, I don't even know. Half the time, I don't know. Jimmy. It would not make sense if Jimmy didn't get a hit. Eddie, it's time to fucking... Come on, man. Eddie. Oh, no. Hurry. That was somebody slow, that's an out. Jesus, there's been more ground balls to second base than I've ever seen. Only one has been made. Oh my, what? Fuck. What the fuck? Okay, that was weird. No, fuck, Jesus Christ, this is falling apart very fast. Look at Jimmy. Look at fucking Jimmy Fox, man. I might take Kershaw out. This guy's kind of uh, heating up against him. I don't know if I want to see it happen. Jesus, man. Adrian. Pretend this was the BR run, Adrian. Jesus, will he hit the ball harder? I dare you. Fuck. I'm not liking this, man. Griffey needs to get a home run right now. It's going to be Griffey. Thank God for the shift for one. Thank God that gave me an act. That may have been a hit regardless. Come on, Frank. God damn it, man. Just can change my mind about everything all season. That's gonna get that's gonna get down. That's gonna leave. I might regret saying that I might change my mind about everything, but man, did he ever come through. Somebody give Babe Ruth a Snickers for fuck's sakes, because he's not being himself right now. Tell me Babe Ruth got a hit. Oh my fucking god, dude. This guy. Jimmy. Somebody stop this, man. Fuck, he's amazing. Okay, this is... I, I really thought this was going to turn. The team is not letting it happen. Maybe it wasn't the worst idea taking... first out of this game. I guess we'll find out. It was heating up with the bat. So... May have been a really good decision, may have been a very pathetic position. What? I'm gonna say position. How did I pass English grade five? I was talking to somebody in my family the other day and I was just butchering words and shit. And I'm just like, this person probably thinks I'm fucking dumb. Like, read a book. Holes is the only book and Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. I was thinking Sergio Romo was my favorite reliever. I don't know why it hasn't been Billy Wagner all damn season. Damn it. Was a good one too. Could have gone all with that. 
Oh, I thought... I thought that was... Gonna leave. Switch hitter, switch hitter, Pujols. Um... Well, I don't know. Fuck it, I'll put Patrick Corbin in. He has a damn deadly ass curveball. Please, Schmidt, for the love of Christ. Well, that's a nice play. Wow, that was bad. Man, Schmidt is getting all the action this game. Okay, you know what would be a good idea to not hang Pujols curveballs every time? This is probably gonna be a huge risk. How did I do that? It's the eighth inning and uh, uh, I was gonna say it's almost over, but I guess it is over. What a fucking performance from the team. That was kind of a hitting frenzy. I think everybody had a hit. Everybody contributed, even Eddie. If Eddie contributed, then that's, uh, that's a miracle, like really much. For a while there, it was almost like the most unheard of thing ever for Eddie to even step up to the plate with a baseball bat. Anyway, now I can go eat my strawberries and Nutella in peace without, you know, spitting all over the room for, you know, playing BR or something. That would have been fitting. You don't want to spit all over the Nutella. It needs to be thick, right? But I don't know.